All right, our next guest, known worldwide for her number one hit on the Billboard dance chart. This is Myra Veronica's hit song, Mamma Mia. And when she's not topping the charts, she spends her time entertaining our troops. Myra's performed for our soldiers overseas in Iraq and Afghanistan, and that same voice just landed her a record deal with none other than Simon Cowell's music label. <laughs> Big name in the music business. We're joined yes. this morning by Miss USO herself, Myra Thank Veronica. Thank you so much for having me. So excited to be here. Good morning. Happy, happy fourth. fourth. Yes, <laughs> happy fourth of July. What's Hi. up next for you? Oh my God, we are now promoting um, Mamma Mia, the new song um, that just got signed, like you said, right. to Simon Cowell's label. Yeah, big, big, big uh, name. So super, super excited with that. Um, that's mostly what we're working on right now. <laughs> that song, Mamma Mia, has topped the charts, the yes, top of the dance charts, yes. also has 12 million hits on YouTube. What was it like for you to see that song just take off? You know, it was actually a Spanish song. It, I actually recorded it about, I don't know, four years ago. It started out as a Spanish song. And then we actually decided to do a top line to it, make it a little bit more pop, a little bit more dance. And sure enough, it caught fire. And now it's, you know, signed to, to Simon's label. You've so. done eight world tours with yes. the USO. Yes. What do That's you get out of that? Part. What's your favorite part about doing that? It has to be very rewarding. You know, to me, to see the sense of brotherhood amongst them, um, the sense of bravery when we would visit the hospitals and we would see some of the Purple Heart recipients to actually, I'd go up to them and be like, are you guys excited to go back home? And they were all just wanting to go back on the battlefield with, you know, with all the other soldiers. So that sense of bravery and courage um, and brotherhood, which is, you, you don't see every day, you know? It's you amazing. recently signed a record deal, as we mentioned, with yeah. Simon Cowell. What yeah. is it like working with him? What's he like in person? Because we um, all see this TV persona. You know, persona. it's crazy because I haven't met him yet. I'm signed to, to the label. Uh, but, you know, I'm excited to. Um, we just did, you know, the, the music video and all with them. And I'm really excited to actually, like, finally meet him. But <laughs> it's crazy, though. You are Cuban-born. Yes. What does this holiday mean to you? It's, this holiday is very important, um, obviously, to, to us Cubans because of what it, what it represents, which is freedom and, and, and independence, but mostly freedom coming from a communist country, obviously, is, you know, it's... Um, Taken for granted here was, by some. Of course, yeah. of course, and that was the main reason why I did everything, and I'm, I do everything that I do for our troops, um, because they ultimately fight for, you know, freedom and give us the ability to do and specifically me with with my singing and my modeling and all that stuff the ability to do you know what I do so. and your singing career has certainly taken off <laughs> when did you start singing how did you get started it's funny because my my father was a singer so I grew up with music uh, but at some point I decided I was gonna go into television I was actually hosting um, entertainment news show uh, and then I met a lot of music producers and stuff and decided let me let me try it since my dad did it and it did really well so you know less than that aspect Tell us a little bit more about uh, your personal life. Where's home for you? I am now living in Malibu, in California. Very, nice. very, very nice. Yes. <laughs> I just moved there. I was in Hollywood Hills and made the switch about a month ago. So super happy. Um, my mom and my my whole family is actually down in Miami. So. So you go back and forth. Quite yeah, a, bit. a lot, quite a bit. A Keep music, a home down there as well. Musically, what's next for you? I, we're doing a lot of work with with Mamma Mia right now. We're touring. We're going over to Italy um, next month, and then we have another song titled Mamma Yo. Um, with the old Mama Yo Quiero, Carmen Miranda feel. So very excited about that as well. <laughs> you expect to put together maybe a full album here now that you have the music oh, deal? Oh, yes, yes, yeah. yes. We've been we're hard, working very hard on that. And when you got that deal with Simon Cowell's label, what did you think? <laughs> what was going you know, through your my, mind? I always say my life has been like Forrest Gump. It's It's been one surprise after another. I wasn't, you know... I wasn't even expecting to get into um, into music at one point, um, so to me, it's it's all been such a, an amazing, amazing surprise. It really has. <laughs> well, Myra, it's great to see you, thank especially you. on this holiday. We thank, thank you very you. much for coming in. Well, do you plan any additional future tours with the USO? Yes, yes. The last one we did was the one that um, captured Bin Laden. That's right. the last one I was on. I was actually traveling with Admiral Mullen, who's the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, and all that was going on. It was it was. Pretty, you know, crazy and hectic. We didn't know until we got back that that's what was actually going on. So I haven't done one since, but we are planning one for Thanksgiving this year. So excited nice. about that. Incredible nice. work. Meyer Veronica, thank you thank so you much for being so here. Much. Thank you for having me. Thank you for your work.